Hi you guys, Zach BBW916 here and I am redoing the my stockpile video because um, before I could post it I showed it to somebody and they said it was too dark. So I guess I'm just used to sitting in a dark room so it looked okay to me but if she says it's too dark I believe her. Anyway, I just wanted to show you guys. Okay, this is my little food stash. This is my wall of barbecue sauce. Look at that. Okay, so all my sweet baby rays. I got a lot of it from CVS, but these last two rolls here, I got um, at Target for 25 cents each. Okay, and then this uh, mustard. You know, even though you can always find mustard on sale, Target had it with the honey mustard dipping sauce for free attached to it. So you know, it came with it. So I paid only for the mustard, which was like 74 cents after the coupon. Yeah, here are my snacks, my Tabasco sauce. So if you ever get tired of McDonald's french fries, you can always throw some of those on there. Uh, my Pringles. Okay, so this side is mostly food. And this is the five-tier rack that I got from uh, Lowe's. for. It was on clearance for $30. I showed you, this was the one that was out in my garage. So anyway, this is going to be my food rack. As you can see, it's pretty bare because I don't do so well on the food as I do at the drug stores. You know, here's some more of my calcium. Thank God I got all this calcium because then after my surgery I found out I had to take calcium. Some snacks which will come in handy when I go to the drive-in tonight. I got some of these bins on clearance at uh, Staples I think. So it comes in handy for those little bitty things. Some nail polish. Um, you know, my friend Maria was going, you know, she said, oh, I want to see your stockpile so I, should kick, I showed her and I, I go to um, change my clothes and I come back and she's picking out which one she wants. <laughs> so it's kind of funny. I told her, let me sort through them first. Um, make sure she's not taking like one of the ones I almost paid full price for. But you know, other than that, she can have at it. Um, this is my bounty that I got at Staples for $1.99 each, six rolls. Uh, this is the toilet paper side. This is not nearly all the toilet paper. Uh, there's two more of these cotton nails out in the garage, and then two 16 rolls um, of Charmin out in the garage that I got at Staples. Plenty of puff tissue. Okay, this is my health and beauty side. Um, this is another one of those uh, five rack uh, things that were outside. So over here we got my wall of toothpaste, and I don't know if you can see back there, but those are my dental picks, uh, you know, flosser things on my hair color. Yes, yeah, so I got to color my hair now. Zantac, um, Excedrin, um, the preparation H that I'm sending my mom. She says she she doesn't know what she's gonna do with them. She says she can't even reach back there. So <laughs> my Zyrtec. Okay, and this is all my mouthwash. Uh, this is my favorite, the Biotin. And so I only got three of those, but you can tell I got like tons of uh, Crest. So that'll tell you what goes on sale more often. Um, there's some toothbrushes. I think these are the ones that I got 60 of them. Um, you know, um, at Walgreens. Okay, this is my lotion aisle, which, you know, it's okay. I could do better. Oh, and I got these uh, suave uh, cocoa butters. They're on clearance at Target. Plus, there was a uh, manufacturer coupon. And then there was a Target coupon that I could stack. So, got a great deal on those. I wish I could have gotten more uh, because now they have these horrible uh, fragrances like cherry blossom and cucumber melon. And normally, like if you go to Bed Bath and Beyond or something like that, their cucumber melon smells fine, but not uh, the ones that Jergens um, or Suave is now making. So, you could tell these are way over here. <laughs> So I don't accidentally grab them and use them. You know, some more lotion, uh, Eucerin and Nivea. And this is my soft soap body wash. You know, lots and lots of body wash. You know, and I got three tones that were on sale. And down here is my hand soap. And those are those automatic hand soaps. And then I have two more over here that I'm going to put um, in the bathroom and the kitchen. My Tylenol Precise, and ladies, if you um, have cramps, 
use one of these, put them on your belly, and go lay down somewhere. Oh, here's some more paper towels, my Viva paper towels, some more puffs. This is a little handle to carry like a whole bunch of bags out of the store with. You know how the plastic bags cut into your hands, or even the recyclable bags. You know, you just, I got this at uh, uh, one of those like linens and things or something like that, or what's that other store, Bed Bath & Beyond. So anyway, that's a, this is a cool little thing. This is my candy, and I thought, oh good, I didn't do as bad as, on candy as I thought. Because it felt like I, every time I turned around, I had candy, 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 candy. Well, I found two bags, three bags in the living room. That's why I didn't think I had a whole bunch of candy, but I do. So, this is my dishwashing liquid, a Glade Air Freshener, uh, some more wipes. Okay, this is my hair care uh, shelf. Um, all that finesse is going to probably get donated. I'm not sure if that's a good brand of shampoo or not, but I really like the Pantene. And you, um, you'll see some of the Pantene in this video, but I have yet to store all of it under the sink, and so that'll be in a different video. And then also, <laughs> since I've done this, um, put everything up, I've been out shopping more, and so now my garage is full of uh, bags again. So... We'll have to be doing this one again, but I won't go through everything. Um, this is my uh, face care uh, shelf, you know, Aveeno, uh, Biore, Neutrogena, all my contact lens solution. And down here is my deodorant, and that's my beat hair remover, all my deodorant. That men, uh, degree men's is going to get uh, exchanged for... Uh, the women's because they told me to just get that and come back and exchange it. And I haven't gotten around to it, but I will. Okay. Ziploc baggies and some more air fresheners. Yeah. Candy, 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 candy. Okay. Okay, you guys. Sack BBW here. Um, we're back and I wanted to show you um, this little basket. Um, just miscellaneous. This is some more of the um, uh, shampoo, conditioner, stylers, you know, some other miscellaneous things that didn't get in uh, to the under bed box. Dental flossers, uh, hair stuff, toothpaste. There's a, um, I got these from ordering um, some coupons online. It was a reach uh, thing that had, um, you know, like several different things you can get. It was a dollar fifty off, like two, you know, either this reach accessor, which I think is really good, and a dental floss, or you can get two dental flosses. Um, it was a coupon that came out before I started couponing, so I ended up ordering them online, and it turned out to be a really good coupon. But anyway, this is just a drop in a bucket to the big IKEA bag I still have yet to put up. So once I get all this stuff put up, I'll show you everything again on my stockpile. So it'll be an updated stockpile video coming your way soon. Don't know how soon. I'm going back to work next week, so don't know how much time I'll have. But, you know, maybe it'll help with my organization. Anyway, talk to you later. Hi guys, SACBBW916 here. And I just wanted to show you one of my under-the-bed boxes before I put it away. Um, this is like carefree uh, panty liners and a whole bunch of uh, Walgreens uh, uh, knee highs. And then about 30 to 40... Uh, Advils um, and for those of you that are worried that I might be hoarding they don't expire until late 2013 so anyway uh, that's just a little bit and as I get going um, I got a little bit more to do in the other room and I'll show you guys alright see you in a few Hi guys Sock BBW 916 here and I'm just showing you another under the bed box that I put together this one is full of razors and I don't even think that's all of them but you know and I know you guys are looking at that big comfort and I apologize for that that was before we knew that it wasn't the right razor for that coupon so you know what can you do following the advice of the experts anyway and these are those Noxema bikini razors um, that's what they look like if you guys never found them 
or if you guys opted to do the four pack of the Noxzema razors, uh, this is what they look like. And I'm pretty sure I got some more razors around here somewhere. Cause Okay, you guys, I just wanted to come in here real quick and uh, show you a couple more things. Um, you know, this is the Wet n Wild nail polish I got. I think I showed you these before. Um, I'm down to four of them. I opened one just to use the little bag, <laughs> um, and I ended up giving the polish away. And then I gave one of these to Maria to keep her quiet, because otherwise she would have wanted me to sort through the nail polish, all the nail polish, right then and there while her family sat out in the hot car. <laughs> So, um, here's some more of the brushes. This still isn't 60. And then since then, I've gotten two cases to donate. Here's some more nail stuff. The wheels for this cart. Some more nail polish and makeup. Some more nail polish and makeup. Gotta love that clearing stuff. Some paper plates. Okay, guys, apparently I'm very delusional about how much candy I have. This is the video, the bag that I showed you, <laughs> or the basket that I showed you before um, in the earlier part of this video. But look what I found. More candy. Tons of candy. Won't need to buy candy. very long time. Oh, and that's not even all of it. Candy and gum. Wow. So, from almost just covering the bottom of this basket to now almost to the top. That's a lot of candy. <laughs> 